I do like how in Sonic Forces you, they don't really need the Chaos Emeralds, but at the same time, it's like, if you didn't need the Emeralds, like, if you already keep it low enough as it was, like, why did you even let it happen in the first place? <laughs> <laughs> Like I love how the uh, the the prequel uh, Twitter comics uh, established how um, like why Eggman didn't just go straight for the Master Emerald. <laughs> what was that? I never read what the prequel the comics. Yeah, me either. Well, uh, one. Um, oh, okay. Knuckles let Silver guard it in his place. Interesting. And two, uh, Eggman was just like, you know what? I have the Phantom Ruby now. I don't need the Master Emerald. Oh, that's still yes, a thing, huh? Yeah, yeah, the Phantom Ruby. Yeah, we. everyone knows what it does. I thought it, like, shattered or something. I have no idea what the fuck... No, I think no one does. <laughs> it doesn't... Whatever the plot says. Um, <clears throat> um no, to my no, understanding... You, 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 you cannot do that. You cannot do that fucking shit, alright? So, Even when Sega like doesn't understand what it does. When Sega doesn't understand what the fuck it does, it just wanted to get rid of it at the end of the fucking thing. <laughs> Let the lore expert cook. Let him cook. Oh, <laughs> uh, what's it? The, the Phantom Ruby, well, first uh, first of all, um, it made its way into uh, modern Sonic's world via the end of Sonic Mania, where it opened a rift, a dimensional rift, uh, to, to the modern timeline. Yeah. Um... Let's see. Okay, but but and is that the real thing or a prototype? It's the real thing, um, Doctor Egg. If if you read the prequel comics, <laughs> dummy. Oh, why do I need to use the read the re prequel comic to understand what the fuck is happening? This <laughs> is not important right now. What is important? <laughs> yeah, 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 <laughs> yeah, yeah, you have no argument for that. <laughs> what is important is that um, what's the, he he used the real Phantom Ruby to create um multiple prototypes. Of uh, copies of the Phantom Ruby, and yeah, then so, so uh, is still, still the double maybe. Oh, <laughs> <laughs> uh, it's it. And basically, what the Phantom Ruby does, as explained in Sonic Mania, is that um, yep. it manipulates uh, reality. Think of it as uh, the the reality stone from Marvel Comics, <laughs> which we've also all read and watched. Yeah. Yeah, definitely. definitely. <laughs> who, who hasn't seen the the Marvel Cinematic Universe? Exactly. Exactly. I don't. I, I stopped watching it after I, Endgame. Basically, it turns it turns uh whatever the whatever the hell you want into a <clears throat> into a real thing. However, um the the Phantom Ruby has also been uh shown to mani uh, manipulate physics as well. <laughs> I see. I see. Where, 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 where? So, okay, so during that acid trip for fucking the city level, I can't remember what it's called, where like Infinite is just like a bunch of snake monsters, that's real. Like that's really happening. Because you, uh, it, yeah, you those she, things uh, are real. Uh, those, things, those, those things are real because they interact with everything. That is, yeah. That's, and then also it's a fucking not, it's also not real at the same time. Yes. I love the Phantom Ruby. I fucking hate this thing. <laughs> <laughs> oh my god. And then ultimately, uh, the, the the fate of the Phantom Ruby is that. Uh... Yep. This is okay. This oh. is brought in from the mobile version of this because Hidden Palace Zone originally was not going to be in Sonic Three, but in Sonic Two. But they did that the. the it did not have time to finish it huh. in the on the files or like the beta of Sonic 2 this level was untextured and stuff but you could still go into it as hidden palace zone huh. so in the original version of Sonic 2 that pit was a really large pit but had spikes at the very bottom huh. and you could not get out even but, as super sonic yep Poor you fella. just have to wait out for the timer <laughs> Yep, and uh, because of that, because of uh, was it Tyson Hess? No, Tyson Hess. Um, Christian Whitehead and his team uh, wanted to bring that zone back at, for the mobile version. Mm -hmm. So and so they replaced that sp uh, that pit. The Emerald. With, oh, I at, broke it. With a um, with a transition into this zone. It's only a one act zone. That's pretty freaking sweet, Lois. But it is awesome. 
that they were able to revive this. Yeah, that's cool. Yeah, in the er in the original game, uh, what's it? You uh, none of the past a certain point, uh, none of the stages' uh, textures were uh, were visible, but um, the collision data was still there. <laughs> uh. Yep. Yeah, it was funny. And then there was also two other zones. It's the master emerald, that... guys. Yeah, master emerald. Now <laughs> you broke it. <laughs> the master emerald. Uh, there were two other zones. There was. Free top zone or is it wood zone? Uh, I think it's either one of those. That there was a uh, like uh, what's it called? there was art of it. Um, um. Concept art. There was concept art of it, but it was never fully made in the game. And some, I think it was like some fans had made. Uh, a whole like the actual version of it in the game hmm. and then there was uh the, i think sand no. sand hill zone or some shit like that which or no that was sonic cd that was like sand hill zone or something like that or it was both more um, like sandy hill <laughs> yeah <laughs> oh god which ty uh christian whitehead and like liked so much it wanted to revive it as uh, really badly <clears throat> and that that zone, that scrap zone that was never ever made, became Mirage Saloon in Sonic huh. Mania. Yeah. That's how you're supposed to fight that thing? I guess so. I used Tails, uh, Tails to hit him from uh, under. Yeah, I just, I just <laughs> thought of that. I'm gonna do that now. Yeah, just do that. Just send this little fella to his doom. Get up there, guy. Come on, little fella. Yeah, you have to keep uh, holding up and jump like that. Uh, pressing uh, the A button, the jump button. Oops. But again, again, if you want to play this for yourself without without spending like forty bucks or like sixty, hmm. no, it was forty bucks. Uh, just go go on your phone or mobile device. Yeah, go on your phone, mobile device, whatever, and just play Got it him. for free. Easy. You have ads, like really quick <laughs> ads, or you pay like two bucks. The on the bright side, I think, uh, I think the mobile version has controller support. <laughs> it does. <laughs> yeah. So you can, if fantastic. you have a USB, you can put like a USB to your phone and uh, your controller. Just or, play it. Or use Bluetooth. Or, yeah, or use Bluetooth. Yeah. Either or works. Yeah, we only have technically three zones left. Ah. Oh. Yeah, see, this is, where I, this, oh, this is where I check out on my casual playthrough of Sonic 2. This is where, like, I, I haven't, I've had enough. <laughs> I'm all good. <laughs> Thank you, uh, Sonic team, for uh, making such a great game. I, I think I'm gonna stop here. <laughs> <laughs> I'm gonna, I'm gonna set this one out. <laughs> Guys, we got oil, though. And oceans. I would still play this over, uh, Three Knuckles, though. Hmm. You're allowed Oosh. to think that. <laughs> <laughs> well, let's let's try this one again. Uh, I do believe that this is uh, in in the lore. I believe this entire zone is uh, made as a as a fuel station for the Death Egg. Ah. I th I thought it was just a um. A fuel station for the American government or gun, you know what I'm saying? Yeah, <laughs> could be, could be. Yeah, yeah they, they go oil. into a. Uh... This is what powered the, they, uh... the space colony arc. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> well, technically, I guess in the lore, uh, space colony arc's uh, already up there and has been uh, floating in yep. space for uh, about 50 years. <laughs> just, just chilling. You know what? You know what's okay. This has been bothering me a little bit. So in Sonic Forces, yep. there is a chemical plant zone, and it's still called chemical plant zone. So is that the same fucking chemical plant zone from Sonic 2? But they just he just added on to it? Or is it just a different chemical plant zone? Because uh. Sonic Forces, you go to chemical plant like I think five times or whatever. Or like huh? three or four <laughs> or five times. So it's like, what? is it still the same it, chemical plant? Uh -huh. What? 
Huh? You know, I huh? I, I haven't huh? um uh, I haven't just go right, I guess. <laughs> I think oh or do that. <laughs> Just skip the, All right. Yeah, um, like I've never seen that happen before. That's the first time I've seen that. You know, for for reasons unknown, I haven't uh touched Sonic Forces in a hot minute. But oh. uh, depending on whether or not um the chemical plant stage or stage is, if at least one of them takes place on an island, it, then it could be plausible that you're revisiting uh the chemical plant zone. Hmm. Because, of course, the entirety of this game takes place on West Side Island. Yeah. <laughs> How would you guys feel if, if furries were real in real life and they all lived on little islands? They were little island they, folk like in Sonic. They don't run- they don't live on islands, they run the government. <laughs> it's true. Yeah, furry made the COVID vaccine, so... <laughs> I'm sorry, I'm, 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 uh, I, I can't say that. <laughs> I think you could, you'll get demonetized or you have, like, the, uh, the little notice on your video. Oh, uh, no. Just say, uh, 19 VC or whatever like that. Just, just rearrange my words. <laughs> or say, uh, or, like, have a text-to-speech or something like that. I don't know. <laughs> you never know. The awesome TikTok text-to-speech. Yeah. It, uh, it's a uh, NIDS, a uh, neuroimmune deficiency syndrome. Oh. Mm -hmm. uh, that's what that's what Maria Robotnik had, according to the the <laughs> Archie comics. <laughs> ah. So do you think that's like hereditary or something like that? <laughs> the one she got. <laughs> uh, it might it might have been a hereditary thing. Yes. So technically, Eggman could have it too, and he could just. Uh oh. Well, no, because, uh, what? well, I mean, I, I, I suppose because, uh, what's it, Mar Maria was also Gerald's, uh, Cousin. grandchild, yes, however, um, you know, Oh, uh, you said Gerald, not Eggman. No, Eggman. Yeah, but, like, uh, what's it, but, you know, uh, Maria's not from the same immediate family as Eggman, because she's his, uh, cousin. Cousin, yeah. Yeah, so. I got turned around somewhere here, apparently. Yeah, so, did. if anything, it's probably the fault of uh, Maria's parents. <laughs> mm. They have bad genes. Whoops. Whoops. What? You didn't jump? <laughs> to get out of there? I did jump. <laughs> but I what did is, jump. What is with your oil ocean run? <laughs> I don't know. <laughs> so, if... This left is the right way here. Yes. That's so. That's so strange. I don't want to go left. Yeah, I, I do. I do believe that uh, oil is the is the most vertical we get in Sonic Two. I'm getting CD flashbacks no, here. No, we ha we have. Um, is it Air Fortress? That's vertical no, too. Metropolis. Oh fuck yeah, that's true. Oh crumbs. I Metropolis. It, it makes me feel like I'm playing Sonic One and Sonic CD at the same time. Oh no! <laughs> <laughs> I, I hope you loved uh, Scrap Brain Zone. You can jump on him. It's just that if you fall into oil, just jump quick because you will reach the bottom very quickly. Oh, uh, no. you you can also fly with tails and just avoid all this. <laughs> True. Yep, just, just jump. Whoa! Whoa. <laughs> Whoa! How quirky. Whoa. Whoa, what the hell? Erm. Just make sure Chael's had enough, oh, okay. like, juice to fly. <laughs> oh, shoot, you lost your ring. Yep, yeah, he's fine. He's fine. Bro. Never mind. <laughs> yeah. That was, uh, cringe? Cringe much? Yeah. Back at it again. Mm -hmm. There you go. See, easy. 
Ishimo. I say that I, I see let tails get back on the ground and then reset the uh, yep. flying animation. Little fellow's getting tired. Yep. He just perished. Nah, that's fine. Shake it off, shake it off. <laughs> Bro. This theme this theme is a banger though, of course. Yep. You lost your ring. I'm i I'm trapped. I gotta get out. If I if I if I do say so myself, I I uh my favorite Eggman boss theme will always be a uh, Sonic One. Fuck. You can duck. I I could. But ducking is easy mode. Yes. <laughs> Are you saying you don't want to take easy mode? Cool. This game's so literally for babies. This game's already so easy. I need to. <laughs> I need to actively go out of my way to make it a challenge. That's locker. <laughs> <laughs> That's does locking is cheating or, or not cheating? It's uh, not the right way to play. Not According to the Game Freak staff. Game Freak staff is always right. Yeah. If I if I recall from uh, an episode of the Kit and Krista podcast, uh, they they do believe it's some kind of like mod or something. And oh. and they're so right. That just kind of gives you a perspective on like what they actually think. Like they don't they don't pay attention to the community. They should make a Pokemon anime where, where if the Pokemon lose, they actually die. That's just Digimon. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> or a dorkly animation. You two, you you decide. <laughs> yeah. Which, which one do you want to watch? A video game <laughs> jokes that haven't been made like fucking fifty million times, or play a different genre of game. Oh, Dorkly's. Um, pretty cool. <laughs> they were. They were. <laughs> it's pretty much just the same uh. thing from like, what, 2008? 2010? What they made? No, why, why wasn't Pokemon Rusty funny anymore? <laughs> you, fucking, you fucking grew up, you're not 10. <laughs> <laughs> Impossible, the writing's just bad. <laughs> Yeah, it's like, man, Dorkly isn't funny anymore. Why uh. is that? <laughs> You're a fucking adult. There was a Some Call Me Johnny reference. <laughs> True. The iconic and Some Call Me Johnny me. Mantis. <laughs> it's literally the easiest enemy I've ever fought. I don't know how he struggles with it so much. <gasps> <laughs> You're you running to oh, your crumbs. death there. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> oh, whoopsie. Hold on. Easy. Oh yeah, now would be a perfect time for me to bring up the fact that uh, what's it? The uh, the the end credits song, the vocal track for the uh, the Sonic the Hedgehog movie, actually takes its uh its drum beat straight from the zone. Yo, uh, I think I saw that on Twitter, like when that movie was out. Yeah. Banger movie, by the way. Honestly, it's, like it's, I get the it, same, it, it, I get the same it, exact feeling from the Sonic One movie as I do from it, Sonic One the game. <laughs> it's all right. Mm -hmm. For for what it was supposed to be, oh yeah, huge yeah. improvement, huge improvement, for the most yeah. part because it's it's still probably running on the same script it was going to originally. But um, yeah, that if it literally wasn't like that, Sonic. Did Sonic would just be done with the movie? <laughs> they, 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 it would have been so bad. It's still, it's, it's okay still, because, it's, uh, it's okay. Like it's, it's not like a <clears throat> control of our. Yeah. Go Oops. left, off, off screen nope. it. Nope. Or oh, okay. Nope. I actually wanted to try this before. I don't think this will work, but maybe it will. Nope. <laughs> Go to the left and then off screen it, and then come back. 
Yeah, we got the. We got Yo, the okay, thing. I guess. That's remember Labyrinth Zone where you got stuck because because <laughs> you could go back up with the <laughs> with the corks. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yep. That was sure was fun. Yep. <laughs> uh, let's. So Damn it. Yeah, Sonic. Sonic One movie. It, it's just again. It's just there to fill its purpose. It's all Sonic right. Two. It's all right. Yeah, if you like Sonic One movie, all right, whatever. <laughs> uh. Sonic 2, the Sonic 2 movie though, it's good because they actually have faith of what they're making. Peak fiction, some might say. Damn it. <laughs> Can you go this way? I don't know. We're going to find out. I, yeah, you could go this way. <laughs> 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 I'm curious in what the Sonic 3 movie is going to be, because I get they're just kind of like, eh, eh, they're just doing Sonic Adventure 2, I guess? Maybe. Because they did, I mean, technically, for like story games, for like, the Sonic games had a story back then, was really Sonic 3, which actually started it, because I know Sonic 2 kind of did, because it has Tails. If you look at the manual, how he became friends with you. But, mm -hmm. like, for if you're just starting the game up, and it's like, who the fuck is Tails? Why is he following you? He's a funky little sidekick. Yeah, that's true. 